Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to go ahead and just do a real quick Dollar Tree haul. We went today, we actually went to one that's about 45 minutes from our house, but I heard it's amazing. And it's actually called Dollar Tree Plus now, which was totally new to me. I hadn't been in Dollar Tree in quite a while, um, but I kept hearing all these awesome things about it and all the new things that they're getting. So I figured I need to go and check it out. They didn't disappoint. They actually had a lot of good stuff. But a lot of the stuff that was there I didn't need and I'm actually trying to declutter my house and not clutter it again. <laughs> so I did go and get, mainly I went and got a bunch of organizational stuff. So I got four of these white buckets. They only had these in the white and then they had a couple of other ones, but they were the, you know, the normal standard, the green, the red and the blue that they have, which I have some of those already in the red and the blue, but I'm just kind of over the red and the blue. I really wanted white. I really wanted it to be clean and crisp and you know, pretty. Um, so I got these and then I figured if I put them in my kid's room or something, I can put some labels on them. I'm actually really tempted to go to another Dollar Tree that's actually closer to my house. Um, there's actually quite a few. Um, I mean, even in the next town over, there's two of them and they're like a mile from each other. So I might actually go there to get more of these because I can use these in my kitchen, my craft room, which is the main room that, oh boy, I really need to start organizing. I mean, it's crazy how much stuff I have in here. Um, so I really want to get some more of these kitchen, craft room, and the kids' rooms. The kids' rooms is probably worse than my craft room. So I got those white tubs, this piece of hair. Um, and then I got these, which I've seen these before, but I've only seen the really small ones or the one that has the, you know, they're split into the squares or the nail polish lipstick holder, which I've never seen a nail polish that will even fit in there. Um, but I did see these and I thought they were really nice to use in my kitchen. Oh, the silverware drawer, because I have some right now, but they're the ones that have the slits in them and my butter knives just kind of slip right out. And so that's really aggravating, especially when I'm trying to put dishes away. Um, so I figured these would look a lot nicer and a lot cleaner in there, um, especially once I get rid of some of the kids' plastic silverware. So I got those. I should probably not catch anything on fire. All right, so now, okay, so I was watching a Dollar Tree haul this morning and they said there's a bunch of books there lately and I love books. I love books. Um, so I did see Exposed, if I could shove this bag somewhere. So I did see Exposed, The Secret Life of Jodi Arias. So I did get this when I'm gonna read it. I don't know, but you know, I can add to my collection. So I got that. And then my son discovered hair clips and he decides that he wants to grab them and shove them open like this until they break. Um, so I just got two from Dollar Store because I only wear them really when I'm cleaning the house or I'm washing my hair, or washing my hair, washing my face. Um, so I kind of just wanted to get a couple of these. They don't seem like the best quality, but I'm totally okay with that. It's fine. It'll work. It'll do. It'll get the job done. And then, just throw that somewhere. And then I saw these scrunchy ponytailers and they're that, it's almost like a, like a shirt material. I don't know. I had never seen these before. I probably overpaid for them. Maybe not. Scrunchies gotten pretty expensive, like at Walmart and stuff like that. I mean, not expensive, but you know. These were a four piece. I like the material. I did get the black and gray. And then I got the pink and maroon. So I like these. I'm really excited to try them. I should have put one in my hair now. And then, why did she double bag this? Oh my God, there's a bunch of random stuff. So my husband decided to get Super Bang Cap Shot. This is probably one of those. Oh my God, I had this as a child. I need it. So that's probably what this was. So, you know, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. There's that. I always get these Advil, Tylenol, what is their migraine? I wanna say that there's another one. I know they have an Advil PM. 
I stock up on these so that way I can put them in my purse. Um, I have a, another container like this in my hall closet that I keep a bunch of Germexes in, um, especially when they're on sale. I keep a bunch of Germex, I keep a bunch of these medicines, band-aids, just kind of extra stuff that when I know something is getting low in my purse, I can just go to the closet, shove it in my bag and go. Um, I really need these, especially on the weekends with my husband. He does get headaches a lot. Um, so yeah, I, I really like do like having this. So, stocked up on some toothbrushes. I love getting toothbrushes at Dollar Tree, especially the ones for my kids. My two-year-old, absolutely loves brushing her teeth and then running off with the toothbrush because she likes to chew on it. I guess it feels good on her teeth. Um, especially now she's getting one of her back molars in. So I just got a three pack. I was going to get more, but right now they have one of those, um, like an electric toothbrush that they're loving right now. So I figured just in case, you know, we needed those. This is another something my husband got. He got waterproof tape. I guess everyone needs waterproof tape for, you know, first aid. I don't know. We're really into having like a million things of medicine. So yeah, see. Migraine, Excedrin migraine. Got, I think I just got one pack of that. Yeah. And, and then I got Zantac prevents and relieves heartburn. Another essential for my bag. We got two of these little I don't know. They're called a ramekin sauce cup. So I really like these obviously for sauces. My kids are obsessed with sauces and dipping everything into anything. Um, so I got these and then Kinsler actually told me that he wants to start doing some cooking videos. Um, he's actually super obsessed with Nailed It on Netflix right now. Um, so right now he's just like, oh my God, mommy, I wanna bake something and we can put it on YouTube, mommy. Like, can we please, I'm gonna make some cake. So I figured what the heck, I got him, he can put, you know, sugar in this one, cinnamon in this one, you know, whatever. I thought it was really cool. So I'm down with that. And then I got a Melon Pro. I actually just got some honeydew the other day horrible or no not honeydew cantaloupe i got cantaloupe the other day and it was such a pain in the butt to sit there and peel the skin off cut it into little pieces so my kids would actually eat it but i figured if it was in this cute little ball i don't know if you can see that cute little ball they would eat it what that is so cool so this part up here it says it removes the rind slices it and puts it into a ball I don't know if I'm even in the camera right now, but remove, slice. I'm gonna have to put a picture up of this because this is super freaking cool. I didn't even realize that. I thought it just did the balls. Cool, kind of obsessed. I kind of need to buy a kennel again. And this is another husband doing. He got cotton twine. I have no idea. I, I can't even like back up what he needed this for. Nor these, he got paracord, he got two. I think he got another one of these actually. I don't know, he got these, who knows why. I think it's like a man thing, like whatever. I got two of these, they come in a three pack, which I love. And again, they're white. Um, my daughter's drawer, she has her own drawer in the bathroom and it is just a disaster in there because she's got bows everywhere on this side. She's got all her hair ties over here and then she throws her toothpaste into this side. So it's just kind of a disaster. So I figured if I have these, you know, put them all together, she can actually, you know, you get me. There's that. And then, of course, I got another book. This one, the only reason I got it was because it had Shay Mitchell. I guess she helped write it. I don't know. Shay Mitchell and Michaela Blandley. Um, it's called Bliss. I don't even know what it's about. Life is not a dress rehearsal. The curtain is up and you are on. So get out there and give it your best shot. 
I don't know. I like Shea Mitchell. Another book. And then I got this for my daughter. It's called Pop Out's Grab Bag. It's My Little Pony. It says it comes with two coloring boards, three washable markers, and 25 stickers. So I thought that was really cool. I've been really into getting, I thought I had another one in here. Anyway, um, at Target at their dollar spot, they have, it's probably like half this size, comes with markers or crowns, a coloring book, and a little bit of stickers. So this is just, I guess, the bigger on steroids version, which I'm cool, totally cool with. Um, so yeah, so I got this. I don't know if it's erasable though. So I might open this and figure that out because that'd be amazing and I would go back for more too. So I got that. And the kids decided to get, this is obviously my daughter's doing. She got a glow wand in pink. It says it lasts for hours, but we'll see. It was only a dollar. So we'll see. And then we got a hundred count of the H2O Blasters water balloons. Um, it's pretty cool. It already comes with a little that so we can shove it into the thingy and fill up the balloon. So I thought that'd be really cool for some sort of summer activity. I saw the, oh, I don't even know what it's called, but you put it onto your hose and it fills up like a hundred at a time. I thought that was really cool, but then I feel like my kids would get obsessed and want more and more and more. And I don't want to clean all that from my yard. So I think I still have like Easter wrappers in my yard. So. And then he got a wannabe Swiss Army knife. Eight and one, multi-use. Has scissors, knife blade, Phillips screwdriver, nail file, corkscrew, flat screwdriver, bottle opener, can opener, and scissors. I think I said scissors. Anyway, he got that. It'll probably like bend. I would imagine that the knife would blend, bend, but we'll see. And this precision, 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 precision screwdriver set. It's like almost midnight and I'm doing this, but I knew as soon as my kids wake up in the morning, they're gonna see all this stuff that we got earlier or yesterday and they're gonna wanna open everything. And I wanted to record this because yeah. So anyway, screwdriver set, six piece. These actually look pretty legit. I don't know if you can even see that, but they're super small. So I guess, I mean, I this would be perfect for, you know, fixing the screw on your glasses and stuff like that. So I guess it's just something that you could always have on hand. Doesn't hurt. So there's that. And again, he got a four function pocket tool, has a knife, a saw, can opener, and a nail file. Okay. And then I got a four piece, four piece? I got four, I got four mechanical pencils for a dollar. So, and these are the paper mate. I don't know. I, again, my head when I'm going through all these aisles, I'm like, okay, wait. Is that a good price? Like, can I get that for cheaper at Walmart? Because sometimes it's like that. Like the pool noodles, you can get those for so much cheaper at Walmart. Anyway, I saw these, but I needed some mechanical pencils. So I was like, what the hell ever, let's get it. So there's that, happy about that. And my husband got some athletic tape, helps prevent sprains. So I guess that's another thing for the first aid kit. He loves having a first aid kit. Um, I mean, every time we go to the dollar store, he's always getting this stuff, always getting band-aids. Um, especially when things are on sale. That's when I like to stock up because Target, you know, they always do the first aid. Oh, buy five Band-Aid products and get a free first aid kit. Um, or not the kit, but the, the container. So I like stocking up on first aid stuff. My kids usually don't hurt themselves. Knock on wood. Um, so, you know, just in case we ever need it. I guess my son got a submarine gun says it lights and sounds. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It'll probably last a couple days. <laughs> but it's cool, it's fine. I don't think you could ever have enough toy guns when you have kids, especially boys, so. And my husband got another paracord. 
another pink one. It's actually pretty cool to say. And then he got an 11 function pocket tool. This I'm totally okay with, if you can see the back. It has a can opener, knife edge, screwdriver, ruler, pocket opener, pocket opener, bottle opener, four position wrench, butterfly wrench, saw blade, direction, and ciliary indication, two position wrench, and a lanyard hole. I'm okay with that, that's pretty cool. Kinsler got some crest kids. Pretty sure I were paid for this, but it's okay. I think it's just the fact that he wants to get things. You know what I mean? It doesn't even matter. He just wants whatever he can get his hands on. So, whatever. Almost done. Okay, so then he got the Super Bang ring caps. 96 shots. So I guess that's for the that other gun, the first gun I showed. So I guess that's the bullet thing for that. And then I got these washable school glue pens. I had never seen these before, but usually when I'm doing stuff in my happy planner, um, I kind of, oh, what is the word? I like Franken plan them together. So I'll use sheets from one planner into another and I glue them together. So that way it kind of, you know, it goes together. Um, so I thought that was really cool. It has a precision tip. So I thought that was absolutely amazing. Usually I'm getting the normal Elmer's glue bottle, the white school glue bottle. Um, and it's just way too much glue, way too much. So I thought this was really cool. Super excited about it. I should have gotten more. I'd probably find this at like Michael's or Hobby Lobby, but I've never, I never buy glue. I buy glue once a year and that's for school. So here's that. And Kinsler got a bug catcher playset. Pretty cool. It has little scissors where you catch the bug in. Huh. I'm pretty down with that. The net probably won't catch anything, but you know, the scissor ball thing. And it even has holes in it so it can breathe. You probably can't even see that. But you know, it's pretty cool. Ugly dolls band aids because band aids. We got another pack of the Colgate Classic Clean Toothbrushes. Just came with a two pack. I love having these on hand, especially whenever, you know, people come over. And then I got a bow and it has the, you know, the normal, what is this? Like an alligator clip? I think that's what it's called. Um, so I thought that was pretty cool that it, you know, just a plain pink bow. So. Oh, I guess we got two of the water balloons. Same thing, H2O blasters, 100 of them. And then we got a PVA chamois towel. I've heard a lot of really good things about these actually. Can... Yeah, see, super absorbent, scratch and lint free and machine washable. Reminds me of the, what is it? ShamWow, is that what it's called? ShamWow. I think I did that wrong. <laughs> anyway, it's pretty cool. One more thing and safety goggles. I guess for my, I think he said they were for my son, actually. Um, my son likes to go outside with Patrick whenever he's working on cars or, you know, what have you. Um, he's was super into doing like science experiments and stuff like that, especially the, with the Coke bottle and the candy. What is that candy? The mint. Altoid? Mento. Mentos. No. I have no idea. Um, so he wanted to do that, but I'm scared that this stuff's going to spray all up in his face. Um, so yeah, I thought that was really cool. Thank y'all so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Like it. Subscribe. Hit the subscribe button down there. Turn on the ring notifications. That way you can be notified every time I upload a video. Um, feel free to comment. Give me any comments on, you know, how I'm doing, how this is going, what you like, what you don't like, if you like this video. Um, I love constructive criticism. Y'all have a good one. I'll see y'all next time. Thank you. Several days later. I wanted to come back in here. I, am, I mentioned in my last video that I was going to go back to Dollar Tree to see if they had any more of these white containers like this. Uh, I didn't see any more of these white ones.
but I did see some gray ones, which I'm totally, totally fine with. It's still a nice neutral color. They're not exactly the same shape. These are squared when the other ones were more of a rectangular shape. Um, I still like the shape. I still love that I can put on a label here if I wanted to. Um, and then I do love the gray. So, you know, that'll pretty much go with anything. And there was also some of these cute ones. So again, they're just a squared shape, kind of small. I wish they would have been a little bit bigger in this gray color, but I've never seen gray at Dollar Tree ever. So as soon as I saw these, I knew I needed to get them. They had a bunch of the round ones, almost like laundry basket looking ones. Um, I definitely don't want to be organizing any cabinets with that, uh, but they were nice to, to look at. I would have gotten them if I needed them, but you know, I don't want to buy it if I don't have anything for it right now. So I got those. And then there were these big ones in this color. It doesn't look like this on the, on the video. It's looking a lot more blue. It's definitely more of a sea foam color. I'll see if I can take a picture and insert it in. Um, but this one's a lot bigger than the gray one. I mean, there's definitely a size difference in this. I mean, a big size difference in that. Um, so I'm excited. I'm gonna go ahead and probably organize my kids' toys with these. So I should probably go and get some more of this big one, but I did, I kind of swiped out all of these, all of these, and all of these ones. So I'm that person that they're not gonna like right now. So, since I kind of cleared out their shelf. So anyway, I just kind of wanted to put that in. I did mention that I was gonna go back. Like I said, I didn't find any more of the white other than the traditional colors that they usually have, the red and the blue and the green. Um, so I, yeah, I didn't find any of these. Got some gray, got some of the cute, I don't even know what shape you would call that. So anywho, I'll go ahead and insert this in as well. So anyway, I just wanted to go ahead and include this um, in the clip with my previous Dollar Tree haul since I had mentioned it before. So anywho, just wanna give y'all a little update. Y'all have a good one.